Hey guys, Hypergames here, and today we're reviewing the Rinke Fusion Kit for the OnePlus 2. Here it says it has an eco package, which means it's better for the environment, environment as it's biodegradable. So this is a crystal clear version, and there's also a smoky black version. In front of the packaging, it says the ultimate experience and simplicity is the ultimate sophistication. Inside, there's a sheet that says thank you and um, more information about the company itself and what to do if you're not fully satisfied. So on the other side of that there's also an installation guide for the screen protector and um, here's the screen protector itself which I won't be using as I already have a tempered glass screen protector. There is also a DIY cutting guide tool which allows you to customise your case. It's basically a stencil which um, lets you cut, cut out um, something that you printed off or something from a magazine um, to put on the other side of your case so it can so you can customise it however you want. So now I'm going to remove the protective plastic and as you as you can see the case is quite flexible so the phone should easily install into the case. So here's my phone and I'm just going to put it in the case now. On the right the power button and the volume buttons are covered and lower down there's also a small K logo. On the left there's a strap holder and a cutout so that you can access the alert slider. On the top there's a DOS cover for the headphone jack and at the bottom there are cutouts for the USB Type-C port and the speaker. The back is just transparent and there aren't any logos and even though the buttons on the right are covered with plastic they are still very tactile because of the active touch technology. The cutouts for the charging, charging port and the headphone jack are perfect and the cables fit without any problems. So here's the um, USB Type-C charger it comes with and I'm um, also going to plug in the 3.5mm jack um, into the thing and as you can see it fits perfectly. So here's the DIY cutting guide tool I mentioned earlier which allows you to customise your case like this for example. So you can put um, you can create something like a logo and print that out and cut it out and put it in your phone case or you could um, print out a carbon fibre texture or leather texture or whatever you want and um, cut it out and put it into the case and then just put your phone in and it looks quite good. So the case is quite bulky but it feels um, premium and overall this case is really good as it offers great great protection and also great customizability and um, it looks kind of cool and it's not too overcomplicated like some other cases. So thanks for watching, if you like this video make sure you sm smash smash that like button if you didn't you know what to do and also make sure to comment and subscribe for more videos like this and check out my other videos thanks for watching bye